So, of course, when I did my uh, letters tier list, letters of the alphabet tier list, it was incredibly popular. And naturally, somebody in the comments said, do the numbers version. And I thought that is a fantastic idea. So today, on this fine Friday, I'm not recording this on a Friday, but you know how it goes. Uh, I thought I'd rank numbers. Now, I could sit here and do like every number to ever exist, but that'll take a long time. And all of those numbers are just made up by the 10 that we have in front of us here from 0 to 9. Let's, uh, let's get going, right? So, zero. Now, zero can always be made better, right? And it can, can always make something better. If you take a number and add a zero on the end, you've improved it. So, I think zero is, is S tier. Uh, number one. Now, one is, uh, is an interesting number. Um... I think A tier is probably pretty good for one. It's missing a few things. Obviously, everyone likes to come first place. Yeah, maybe one is S tier. One, one is probably S tier. Two is uh, B tier. B tier. Two is not amazing, but it's not like bad, you know. Three. Now, three is not a good number, but three is a magic number. Three is a magic number. Three. So it's going to go in A tier, just because it's magic. I don't really like the number itself. 4. Now, 4 is going to go in D tier for me. It's such a mid number, right? Um, the only thing that saves it from being an F is the fact that it's even. You know, if it was an odd number, that would make things so much worse. 4, I don't give a shit about 4, okay? 5, on the other hand, has got to go in S tier. Okay, your, your, your five times table is always so satisfying. You know, five is like the only truly valid odd number. Six uh, is going to go in C tier. Horrible, isn't it? It's, again, it's just such a mid number. You, you like all the even numbers and then you get like 26 and it's like... Ugh, ugh. Uh, seven is going to go in A tier. You know, it, it's another one of those... So, you see, five is like the most valid odd number because you got, you know, the 5, 10, 15, 20. It's nice. Seven is like a good odd number, and it's a lot of people's lucky number, you know, Cristo Ronaldo and stuff. However, it's not quite as satisfying as five. You know, you got seven, 14, 21, 28. It's not the same. It's not the same. So, personally, seven, just a step below five. Eight is going to go with two in B tier. It's just mid. It's just mid. In fact, eight might, might actually go in C tier. I'm not sure. We'll put it in C for now, but bear in mind, I'm not. 100% convinced. And then 9, uh, I think, is probably going to go in D tier with, with 4. 9, 19, 91. They're all just mid numbers. I, I don't I don't really care about 9. Uh, and I think that's going to conclude our tier list. Um, of course, there's more nuance to it. But, you know, there's, there's different ways of looking at it. You know, like 99 might be above D. Uh, or 95 would definitely be above D. We're doing the individual numbers, and and that is this is where we are at the moment. And I think this is a pretty good ranking. Let me know what you think in the comments. And as always, I will leave a link to the tier list in the comments because of course you want to do this yourself. Uh, but with that being said, I'm going to bed. Back off.